Welcome back to Draymond Does Gaming. Draymond here playing more Symphony of War. And today I think we're just getting right back into the chapters. We're going to go chapter 22, Grey Wind Peak. Let's get going. Oh, we can only deploy eight? Okay. Lots of dragons. Interesting. Iron mine. Obsidian. Kind of want both of those. What is our... Uh... Just, just get the shrine. Okay. Nine turns. All right. Um. Hmm. Who do you want then? <clears throat> Probably some of our better units. Some of our faster units would be good. I'm going up against dragons. Oh. I don't really want to bring like Rascuja or Stefan. Uh, maybe Lysander could. Hmm. Yaromir could be one more too. Yeah. We're Ephraim. Let's go Ephraim. This is weird only having not very many units. <laughs> um Yeah, so obviously we need to go up and North and east. Sending you guys up there. You'll probably be fine. Cloud render over there. Um, yeah, I mean, you can send like four and four. Seems okay. That's not so bad. <clears throat> yeah, you have to excuse my coughing and stuff because I'm... Just getting over being sick. So. You know, fun times and all that. Is this tree something? No, okay. It just looked very odd. Get everybody over here just up. Okay, there we go. Cloud render can come up here. Take out this guy. Nice. We can come in and take out this guy. <laughs> so good. Fantastic.
Now these guys should be able to fly, right? So I'm, I'm like tempted to send her here and attack in. I think that's actually going to be okay. We'll try it out. Yeah, pretty good. So many dragons. Okay, let's see what we can do here. We have Meteor available. Um, so let's use it. Might as well do that. <clears throat> okay. Barnabas, get him. Okay. That's fine, because we can move back out. Then Lysander can come in and blast. Nice. Pretty good. Uh, I think I'll just wait right there. And then Ephraim can come up and take out or start attacking these guys, anyways. Nice, took out one of them. Uh, yeah, Cloud Render. Start heading up. All good so far. <laughs> nice. Um, hmm. Oh, I didn't mean to end turn. Whoops. I was thinking about using a power on, yeah, the uh, blessing one on them, the damage reduction. Oh well. Nice. Perfect. All right, Cloud Render, you're going to head up that way. Abigail's just having fun here. <laughs> There we go. Yeah, that didn't work out that great for me. All right. You guys get up in there. Let's just heal up a bit. Might be good.
All right. And Ephraim can come up here. Take that guy out. Nice. Um, yeah, we we'll want to do that. We could actually just have you guys go again so you won't get ambushed. That would be good. Uh, yeah, I'd say that was pretty good. Now, what the heck does this thing do? Mass and morale, morale damage. Okay. All right. I don't think it matters too much for us, but we'll use it. Okay. Perfect. Fantastic. Huh. There we go. <laughs> it's so good. So very good. Keep blasting. Eventually we'll take them out. There we go. Grab the mine. And surrender these guys. Perfect. Rude. Very rude. All right, Cloud, <laughs> cloud Render, let's go get that. Um, yeah, we can attack in here. Nice. You guys can come in as well. Nice. still can't reach oh well uh yeah we'll revive and heal that guy and we'll surrender this guy nice and then beyond that We're nearly done. 
Okay. Well, we might as well use this. And then just blast them as hard as we can. Nice. Uh, yeah, let's throw down a heal. Because we can. And then next turn we can probably get both of these guys to attack in. As well. Oh, we wouldn't even need it. All right, perfect. <clears throat> All right, perfect. Yeah, pretty awesome. All right. Here we are, the Shrine of Galsus. Your upgrade awaits, Diana. Still sealed away. Seems the Empire hasn't figured out how to open these doors on their own yet. Else they would have already. Something's calling out to me. It's difficult to resist. Huh. Well, there we go. This is it, Diana. Can't you feel the power crackling beneath you? Exhilarating. This is surreal. The closer I get to the shrine, the rest of you seem to disappear. Interesting. That is a big treasure chest. Interesting. That gauntlet is huge. By Donar, the power overwhelming. Well, okay. I'm certain I haven't touched drink today, and I think I'm already hallucinating. Welcome back, Diana. How do you feel? Grateful to be home. How long has it been? Only a few moments for us. Donar's will, the boon of Galsus has come to Tarna. 
I only hope I am worthy steward of this gift. Hell's Bells, the goddess of war, just got even more goddessy. It just got real bad to be a bad guy. <laughs> Stefan, really? <laughs> All right. The next Nephilim shrine lies within the royal palace, the capital of Sayuna, the kingdom of gold. Sayuna is an ancient land that grew into a vastly separate culture from the rest of humanity long ago. Their land is covered in deserts and high mountains, though its mines seem to spill forth with gold and jewels without end. Because of this wealth, the world has sought the riches of Sayuna for centuries, and very few have been able to dent the staunch natural and human defenses that protect the region. But the might of the imperial campaigns of conquest subdued the kingdom, forcing a military alliance. To preserve their culture, Sayuna has become a tributary state to the empire. A war in Sayuna would be a monumental challenge. Some of the mightiest imperial armies are just a stone throws to the west at the imperial stronghold of Stormrook. Do the Sayunari people deserve to be subject to bloodshed, or are they too far gone, too loyal to the enemy? On the cusp of a decision with great consequences, Draven weighs his options. Yeah. Unwise alliance. Interesting. <clears throat> Lysander, are you alright? It's finally become reality. Hmm? You're just completely out of reach. You may not have noticed, but I haven't been able to free my mind of you. But no need to rebuke my foolish words. I see reality even more clearly now. Lysander. Am I not of the right caliber? I don't know. This is silly. You're General Lysander, not some groveling supplicant. Look at all you've accomplished. Do you not realize how revered you are by those around you who wish they had your gifts? To be honest, my merits in the art of war, it doesn't matter that much in the end. Not compared to what in my mind could be, and with whom it could be. I understand. I do this for Alex. The fight next to that is secondary. Of course, I'm sorry, Deanna. I've certainly lost any sense of decorum. That's not necessary. All anyone asks is for you to be who you are. Already one of the greatest heroes of our time, with even more feats to come, right? We shall see. Alright. Marima is very confident in the Sayuna strategy. Claims that her people wish for outside intervention. What do you think? Are we doing the right thing here? To be frank, no. Alright then. That doesn't mean it's not strategically sound. Indeed, it may be the only way to pull the Sayurni away from the Imperial Yoke. Morally, I find an alarming shift from your former attitude towards this war. Perhaps, then, it is better that you are our leader and I am simply the Vizier. You see, you baffle me sometimes. On one hand, when I vow to have the cultists utterly destroyed, I see only your approval. But now, I just pray that the Sayurni don't... Do not have to suffer by our hands or by Casimir's. Their history is plagued with suffering. I hope they choose wisely. Agreed. Alright, we're just going to check out a couple things here. Oh, cool. I might pick up a few more people and stuff, but... I'm not worried about it right now. Dragon scale armor. Nice. Always picking up these. Interesting. Okay. But that's going to be it for me today. So thanks again for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye for now.